So here it is guys, a teaser trailer for Exo Zombies in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. This is going to be kicking off with the first DLC map pack that will be coming out in January for Advanced Warfare. This looks pretty damn crazy. And there's actually some very cool little things hidden away in this teaser that I'll point out to you guys as well. So without further ado, take a look at it and then I'll bring you guys more information. When Atlas dropped the bomb, they hoped it would finish the war. Instead, it unleashed a freak show like no one's ever seen. No warning, no backup, no one left, but us. Oh, baby, things are getting interesting with Exo Zombies. Remember, this is just a teaser, so I'd expect some sort of full trailer leading up to the launch of the very first map pack that will include Exo Zombies. But let's take a look at what we have actually seen within the trailer itself. So, something I do like about this trailer is it gives us more information into the backstory of what's going on here. Why are there suddenly just zombies around in the future in Advanced Warfare? Well, for those of you guys that played the campaign or watched me play the campaign or even played multiplayer and know of the DNA bomb. That bomb is basically uh, controlled in a way that when it goes off, it can choose who survives and who lives through the DNA of the people that they are choosing and selecting to live. And obviously, when this bomb went off, in this situation, it screwed up massively, killed a load of people, but also left these mutated zombies because the DNA bomb did not work properly. I like it. I think it's a cool storyline. It links into something that we've already had before previously in Advanced Warfare so it's not just some crazy zombie infestation for no reason at all and it's very interesting. On top of that we've got some big named actors all being used as the four main characters within Exo Zombies. Maybe you know some of the actors, maybe you don't but they're definitely going all out for Exo Zombies. Uh, but some of the big things included in this trailer are, were literally only shown for a few frames but I went through it and found that of course the Exo Zombies are going to actually have some of them at least the exo pack on them meaning they're going to have different exo abilities they are running extremely extremely quickly and i also wanted to have a look at the map that they were playing on because to me that's actually quite a big thing so First of all, if you take a look at this image here of one of the zombies using the exo ability to jump up, you can see in the background there are actually multiple coloured eyes on the zombies. So there's a red-eyed zombie who's just covered at the moment, but you can see the red glow around him. You've got the blue-eyed zombies which have got like electrical current around them. And then the, what's, what seems to be the more standard zombies with the orange eyes. Now, either this means each of these zombies have different abilities linking in with their eye colour. So maybe some of them, if they run at you, will actually shock you and stun you for a little bit. Maybe some of them have like sort of like some sort of flame ability. But it looks like there will be different categories of zombies. You're not just going to get one type running at you for the whole time. So you've got to be aware, you've got to be on your toes because all of the zombies will do different things. And I'm excited for that. I'm glad that that is the case. This is very, very interesting. Next up is the map. Now, I mentioned the map, and I think this is important because the only time we've seen Exo Zombies so far has been on one of the multiplayer maps called Riot. And I was hoping that they wouldn't do that again. And it looks like they haven't because if you have a look at this freeze frame here, you can actually see that on the right hand side, it looks to be some sort of map for where they're playing on basically. And this does not look like any of the multiplayer maps we've seen before. Now having said this, if they could be playing on one of the DLC multiplayer maps included in the first map pack, but I'm hoping that's not the case. I'm hoping it's going to be its own unique map, which is great. It means that it's going to be designed around Exo Zombies solely, meaning it's going to work well for Exo Zombies. And I cannot wait to get my hands on this and start playing it. So that's been pretty much everything I've gathered from this teaser trailer. Let me know what you guys are thinking of it. Or if you've also seen anything extra, throw it down in the comments. Let each other know what you're thinking because this is going to be crazy. And of course, subscribe. I'll keep you guys updated on everything zombies related for Advanced Warfare and DLC related as we lead up to its launch. Check out more stuff on screen here, guys. We've had some DLC cameras recently. We've had uh, GTA 5 stuff recently. Loads of exciting stuff. So cheers for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video.